from Never Enough Notes. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. I am at the Great Escape today in Brighton, and this is LA Foster from Montreal in Canada, who's just played a show at the Canadian Blast stage at the Green Door Store. Um, we want to chat firstly about your impossible to say EP name. I want to say I want to say Sodad, Sodaj, 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 Sodaj. Yeah. Please say it. Sodaj. Sodaj. So yeah. your EP came out in November last year. Like, how how has that been going with the release? Is it all? I mean, it's well. cool. I mean, self-release, so mm -hmm. it's, you know, I think doing well for yeah. being an independent artist. I'm happy, for sure. What was your process like getting it to release? Um, well, I worked with a producer, Stephen Ramsey. He's mm -hmm. in a band called Young Galaxy. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so we worked together. I brought him tracks, and then we kind of worked them out together. He kind of added some of his flavor, and that was that. Yeah. yeah. How long have you been an artist? How long have you been making music? Well... L.A. Foster started in 2014, mm -hmm. kind of spontaneously a friend asked me to go to Mexico City to be a part of his, uh, what, an art show, mm -hmm. and just to kind of to make some music to come accompany it, and so yeah, in 2014 is when L.A. Foster started, I was singing in Mozart's Sister, mm -hmm. like 2013, a little bit of 2012, but that's, that was it, yeah. Yeah, and like what inspires your sound, because a lot of your songs are kind of a bit of heartbreaking, there's a bit of sort of... A bit of melancholy in there. What do, what, what do you really feel like you write about? Are you are you getting off getting emotions off your chest, or I mean, what is that? Yeah. About? I mean, that's why the EP is called Saudade because it means it's important. Like, I used to live in Buenos Aires, mm -hmm. so I spent some time in Brazil, and Saudade is a word that doesn't really translate to English. It's the love that remains after something is gone. So yeah, I mean, it's a lot about loss and a lot about like hopefully like. <laughs> Insp inspirational as well, like the light that happens after you're all fucked up. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's fine, swear away, we'll just, we might not believe that out. I don't know. So like, what's, what's coming next? So your EP's been released, and you're also doing the promo for that. I mean, what, what are your next plans? Um, to write, I'm writing a new record. Yeah. So like, in terms of writing, are you writing this EP, is an EP or an album, or are you not really that far across yet? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm hoping for an LP. That's the goal. Excellent. Yeah. Is it going to take the same form, you know, sort of the heavy sampling and things like that? Or? Yeah, I think it'll take the same form, but it may not be like as, uh, I don't know, as like hard on my sleeve, but mm -hmm. it probably will be because like that just seems to be the way I write. We're going to pick some questions out of here and we're going to see what else we can find out about LA Foster. What's your favorite hometown venue? In Montreal, there's so many great old theaters. I would say that the Corona Theater is amazing, but also Metropolis is an insanely cool venue to play. It's like got great sound, great vibes. So. Yeah, it's always good playing home though, right? It's yeah. amazing. Let's see what else we can get. Let's get something crazy. Okay. What genre do you think is making a comeback? I mean, anything 90s. I even yeah. feel like in my music, like there's a little bit of that 90s kind of vocal driven stuff. I feel like that's kind of making you come back. I also feel like drum and bass kind of vibes are coming back as yeah. well. Like that's, which is I totally dig, so. Uh, let's have another one. Oh my. You can't see this down here, I'm sorry. Okay, if you, if you could be a fruit for the day, what would it be? Passion fruit. Passion fruit, why? Because <laughs> I'm passionate. You're passionate. AF. <laughs> Lovely. Ellie Foster, it's been really awesome to meet you. Enjoy the rest of your tour and then welcome to the UK and Thank you. come back.